it. When God blesses, it affects all areas of your life. Welcome to today's DDRX. The anchoring scripture is Psalm 107 verse 2. Let the redeem of the Lord say so, whom he has redeemed from the hand of the enemy. The prescription is say a blessing. I want to look at the fact that the blessing of the Lord makes rich. Proverbs 10, 22, the blessing of the Lord makes one rich and he adds no sorrow with it. The blessing of the Lord makes one rich and he adds no sorrow with it. When God blesses, it affects all areas of your life. It is all around. You know your health, your family, your business, your career, your children, your city, your nation. It cuts across everything that is named after you when God blesses. So God's blessing is not limited to material acquisition. God blessed Abraham. It affected all areas of his life. The Bible says Abraham was very rich in livestock, in silver, and in gold. He was rich in livestock, in silver, and in gold. So the blessings of the world come with sorrow. But God's blessings don't come with sorrow. You don't have to worry because it is good and perfect. It is a complete package. The blessings of the Lord make rich. In James 1:17, every good gift and every perfect gift is from above and comes down from the Father of light, with whom there is no variation or shadow of turning. Uh, let's say blessing together. You know, let's say blessing together. In Genesis 18:17, and the Lord said, Shall I hide from Abraham? what I'm doing? You know, shall I hide from Abraham what I'm doing? No wonder. Abraham, you know, was very rich in every area. He enjoyed divine secret, divine revelation. May God's blessings locate you. Say a blessing. Thank you.